Hey Internet und YouTube, weiter geht's mit Game of Thrones. In der Kälte. You're freezing. Yeah, don't worry about it. Someone has to keep watch. <sighs> oh. It's getting worse, isn't it? But we're only about a few days out from the Antler River. We cross a bridge the first men built. And from there, we can try to find the North Grove. Uh, right, Sylvie? We're not going North. We're going South, to join Mance, and the rest of the Free Folk. But look... That was always the plan, Cotter. I have to go to the North Grove. My family's depending on it. <laughs> Your family needs you to wander around in the snow until you get eaten by a direwolf. Please, Sylvie. He knows what he's doing. Does he now? Tell me then. How did my brother get that gash in his arm? You dressed his wound up well enough. But why'd he get hurt in the first place? What does that have to do with the- Hush, Cotter! I'm asking Fishface here. Whoa! Sylvie! Don't Sylvie me. I want to hear it from him. Some wildlings. Uh, free folk. Uh, mistook Cotter for a crow. Can't imagine why. We tried to reason with them and well, well things got out of hand. Out of hand? From the look of him, he was nearly killed. Point is, you don't belong out here. Sylvie, I've known Gadid a while now. He may not be one of us, but I trust him. I've been waiting months for you, Cotter, and when you finally come home, it's with some crow who can barely build a fire. No. We don't need to die for him. Me neither. Fucking North Grove isn't even real. And if it is, it's probably full of wolves and more wildies. Fens, probably. <laughs> you didn't lose your nerve already, did you? Finn, will you co Just piss off! Some leader you turned out to be. You should listen to him. The further north you go, the more likely you'll never come back. It's just not worth it. Once Cotter's fit to travel, we head south. With or without you, Garrod. Sylvie. You need to rest. And we'll be wanting something to eat. I won't go far. Oh, don't be angry, Garrett. This isn't what it looks like. I can explain. Did you know she'd refuse to go north? I swear, I didn't. I thought she could help. Sylvie knows these woods better than I do. If anyone can find the North Grove, it's her. And besides, I couldn't just leave her. I won't do that. Not again. Then convince her to go with us. She's your sister. Well, maybe she's right. Maybe you don't belong up here. You don't mean that. So that's it. I can't head north without a guide. I go where she goes. I'm sorry, Garrett. Boah, danke für nichts. Braucht niemanden. Garrett. So you really won't take me north? I want to help you, Garrett. I mean it. But I can't leave her behind. And besides, north of here, I'd be as lost as you. How's your arm feeling? Decent, I'd say. Why'd you ask? Oh, you mean this one? 
Yeah, it's shit. You and your sister, you, uh... You don't look much alike. The white hair and... I know what you're getting at. So you may as well just say it. I, I just wondered. She was born like that. My mother used to call her Little Moon. The rest of our village thought she was a bad omen. The better of them stayed away from her. The worse? <sighs> Let's just say I'm glad to be rid of them. What happened to your village? Did you leave? Well, not by choice. When Sylvie reached two years, they told my mother we weren't welcome anymore. <laughs> she wasn't welcome. I guess they all hoped she wouldn't survive long enough to get a name. <laughs> but she's tough, Sylvie. No way she wasn't gonna make it. Where's your mother now? <laughs> I don't know. Still back at the village for all I know. She tried to send my sister away. Wrapped her up in furs and everything like a good mother would. I left that night when I heard. Why were they afraid of your sister? Same reason you southerners call us wildlings. Same reason you put up that wall to keep us out. People are arseholes. Why didn't you just tell me the truth? That you came here to find your sister. I wanted to. I didn't think you'd understand. I couldn't risk it. I'm sorry. Okay. Wenn wir sie mal überreden müssen, oder? Vielleicht mit einer Heldentat? Wahrscheinlich. Ich werde sie retten. Don't know why you'd want this around. Yeah, Kunst, my friend. Modern Kunst. Mich hat's ja jeder verlassen. Oh, muss ich mit der quatschen? Wo ist meine Maus? What are you doing over here? There's a perfectly good fire. I'm not going anywhere near those fucking wildlings. Oh, come on. Just give them a chance. I did. And look where it got us. I'm sorry for getting you into this mess. Really. Not your fault. I wanted to come. Just didn't know this is how it turned out. Come on, Finn. You'll freeze your ass off if you stay here. Suppose you're right. May as well get warm before I die. Exact. Ich glaube, Silvi steht ein bisschen auf mich. Das ist wahrscheinlich der Grund. Little Moon. Mhm. Mm Wonder if her mother gave her that. Oh, well, it's not so bad. Man muss ja nicht alles alles testen, was so herumsteht, oder? Einfach ja, super. Haben wir einfach Silvis Schnaps weggetrunken, eine Alkoholikerin. Could you have been any louder? Sorry. Never met a crow before. Sorry I almost killed you. Might have done you a favor though. Plenty of things want to kill a crow up north. Giants, thens, shadow cats and ice spiders. And the White Walkers, of course. A spear sounds nice after all that, doesn't it? I'm not a crow anymore. I left that life behind me. Once a crow, always a crow. 
That's what they say, anyway. Don't frighten our dinner away. Shit. It's my turn. Oh, really? You even know how to use that thing? You're not going to shoot me in the leg, are you? I never miss. Bisschen angeben. <lacht> ich würde sowas von daneben. Oh no. Uh, click and hold, release the fire. Oh! Well, you're right so far. Gott sei Dank. You'll do nicely, little one. Will that be enough? <lacht> You've never seen Cotter eat. We'll need another. Nein, 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 nein. Ich war auf dem... Ich... Are you nervous? Ich... Nein. Maybe Desktop. next time, Garrett. It's not much, but it'll last us. Ich... You're not half bad with a bow. Could come in handy. Oh, Sylvie, ich konnte... Kennst du PCs? You ever lost anyone, Garrett? Someone you really cared about. Someone you thought you couldn't live without seeing ever again. Do you know what that's like? I lost my family. First my mother, then my sister and father. So you know how it feels. Cotter and I, we lost everything too. And we nearly lost each other. I didn't think he'd make it back this time. And I won't risk losing him again. Not even for the North Grove. You know something about it, don't you? Only what I've heard. But don't get your hopes up. It's not worth it. Please, Sylvie. I need to know. A few years back, one of the Aish River clan set out to find it. They'd heard stories. That the cold couldn't touch it. That it's safe, even in the dark of winter. So they'd set out, all full of hope. And none of them ever returned. Do you believe the stories? Oh, I forgot. You southerners don't believe in anything you can't see with your eyes. Garrett! Help! Cotter! What the fuck? Look out! Oh, hi! This looks like the place. <laughs> this is definitely the place. So, who are we dealing with exactly? Pit fighters. Two go in, one comes out. Day after day. No rules, but kill. Anyone who can survive that is capable of anything. They're crazed savages. But one pit fighter is worth any ten cell swords. If you can convince them to fight for you. And that's not going to be easy. Don't expect to charm them or reason with them. If we're very lucky, we'll walk out with our heads. I've got enough gold to buy them all. Mm, I'd be careful flaunting it. <laughs> oh my god. Must make you feel pretty good, seeing the Masters overthrown. They're not gone. They're just on their knees. And when they get back to their feet, they'll be more dangerous than ever. Mm, 
sieht gut aus hier. You did what? Trust me, you don't want to get involved, Russia. Holy Oh, uh, one last thing. They're not fond of strangers. Or anyone who shows weakness. Or fear. I can handle this. Oh, after you then. Well, if it isn't Beska, the fucking basilisk. We just want to talk to Amaya. You don't want to be in here, little man. You best go back the way you came before I decide to eat you. I'll start with your eyeballs. Fucking juicy when they pop. And then I'll pull out your little bones to pick my teeth with. You think I'm scared of you? Why don't you threaten me one more time and see what happens? You listen to me, little man. You've got to the count of three to turn around and walk away. One, two. You're scary, fat man. Good thing I'm looking for scary. I need fighters like you. Hear that? This little man wants us to fight his battles for him. We do what Amaya says. You talk to her. Well, good, because that's exactly what. Hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa! Amaya! Kleine freche Amaya! Wo ist sie denn? Ja, kann ich hier durch? Entschuldigung! Holy shit. Well, hello there. Amaya! Take her! You must want something pretty bad to risk coming in here. So, out with it. Before I decide not to let you leave. I've come with an offer. One that'll interest you and your men. If you wanted my interest, you wouldn't have shown up with her. Amaya, please! Please what? I had a friend once, the Basilisk, but she died a long time ago. I earned my freedom! You walked out on me. On all of us. Fighting side by side, we were goddesses of the pits. Leave her alone! I don't care what your history is. Beska's the most loyal friend I've ever had. So, what is it that you want? Why shouldn't we rip you to pieces and feed you to the beast? My patience wears thin. My enemies mean to butcher my family in Westeros. They killed my father. They killed my little brother. And now I need great warriors to help me avenge their deaths and reclaim my home. You think we sell swords? We don't fight other people's wars. We are pit fighters. Artists who paint in blood. That was yesterday. The fighting pits have been closed. You're all free now! 
free to do what you want. Don't you see that? Yes, we are free. Why would we follow another? We don't have masters anymore. Why would we follow anyone ever again? I'll make you all rich. Your masters, they used you. They made gold from your blood. But I am offering you a chance to earn for yourselves. Amaya, trust me. He's got enough gold for all of you. You want to lead pit fighters? You have to earn their respect first. We don't know who you are until we see you bleed. You're gonna have to show them you can fight. All right. Who? Who's the best you've got? His name is Bloodsong. He's vicious, fearless, and fast. Oh, I've never seen him before. Take a good look there. He's the man who's going to kill your boy. Ich hab doch geklickt. What's the matter, Westerosi? Choosing your last words carefully. Well, suppose I better get this over with. So what are you supposed to be? With your little axe and your pretty blonde beard. I'd sooner bend you over to fuck than fight you. <laughs> Thanks for noticing the beard. <laughs> well, come on! Let's see how you die! If I die in there. Yeah? You have a dying wish? This ought to be good. Will you return to Westeros and kill as many White Hills as you can? No. I'll spend all your gold on the finest of halls. Hey! I need those! You'll fight with the weapons we give you. Oh shit, lass mich bitte nicht verklicken hier! You all see this cockless Westerosi? He's come to order us to battle. Like our masters did. I kill no man because another orders me to. I kill a man because it pleases me. Let me show you how we dance in Marine. Look, this wasn't my choice. I'm not here to kill anyone. Well, we all know that's true. <laughs> oh, I glaube, das wird böse enden und wir sehen uns. <laughs> Im Kampf, im nächsten Part. Danke fürs Zusehen. Und äh, ich glaube, hier entsteht eine zarte Freundschaft. Tschüss.